the one that plays Inkling and Yoshi is XDX first. Um, this guy's Ron Lever was in this tournament. He played Hbox. The legend, man. Charlie's natural enemy, the Samus main. <laughs> I played Ron Lever today, actually, on Elite Smash. I, I did okay in Elite Smash today. I'm almost, like, to 8k with Link. But I don't know if, like, that's <laughs> anything to boast about at all. I don't, Paul, it, I don't, I don't think I have any characters with that much GSP. I'm 7.9 right now. I'm... GSP is nothing to boast about, but I am, like, chip on my shoulder, like, okay, cool, there are some things I'm doing better than I wasn't doing. Anyways, we could talk about Elite Smash some other time. Ven vs. Sierra up here. Good to see Vegas come back on the map. Always happy to see them come out to these tournaments. We did have Grandmaster last week. Ven makes a return here with the Zelda, of course. You guys already know I don't like Zelda, but hey, Ven definitely knows how to put in work and make her exciting. Yeah, Ven's like, I feel like this point since we've been playing Zelda so long in like every Smash game, even when she was completely terrible. He just like tries to, to mix up and use like all of her tools to the best of his that's what makes him so good, this character, I think. Yeah. I, I like to, I, for those of you guys who've been listening, oh, that was kind of, I'm going to there. That's kind of one of those things that Zelda doesn't have to really worry about. It's coming back on stage, or fighting on stage, because teleport can definitely get around Ness, but also punish Ness at the same time. And Knight is very much a Marvel 3 assist, <laughs> so you have to be careful. Zelda can not only use them offensively, but defensively as well. No, oh, no. Nice. I respect it too, because Nehru's love off the stage has intangibility, but on the mark here, that is the Roy Mustang. That was very, very good snipe. Okay, but back to even here. Nice side magnets. Oh, okay, yeah, I like the choice they gave with the Nitro V, because he, he looked like he was jumping in a way to set up the PK fire. Like, short yeah. off PK fire. Okay. Nice. Waiting out the Nehru's now. I feel like once you can condition the, the Zelda players to go for that a lot, you can get some really hard punishes. Yeah. You can definitely get some hard punishes. Good, I was gonna say, that's good on Ven to actually fight Ness in the air. That I've kind of forced him to try to land, possibly, and then face Knight from there. Yeah. Seraph movement looking really tricky. Ven can't really get a, a beat on him, what he's gonna do. Yeah. Nice. Nice up beat from the ledge again. He hasn't, he hasn't blocked that yet. I just don't no, think he respects the up beat of Bucks. Yeah, uh, the fire win is just really, it's hard. I honestly, it, it comes out so quick. Yeah, it has so much knockback, but also like, it's it's pretty big too as well. There's a lot of things to factor against Fowers win. And, oh nice uh, no. Here. Nice catch. I can, I can see where Ven was probably starting a neutral air to kind of catch that from Zero, but unfortunately it was a little bit too slow on the draw. Yeah. No tech chase there. Almost gets the shield break. Shield pressure. I see you've seen uh, Ven play this matchup, because I know he's played so much versus a uh, foe's nest. But I guess a playstyle difference means a lot. Oh yeah, coupled that with Wi-Fi, Ness over Wi-Fi, I guarantee you get like two extra frames per move. It doesn't feel right. That is very true. Oh my god, that up air hitbox is crazy. Syrup definitely didn't expect to get hit by that. That actually caught his foot. Again, I like Syrup's uh, patience in dealing with the Mary's love. He's holding shield, giving a free punch every time. Nice, snag the jump. And uh, yeah, he's starting to respect that up the hitbox at the ledge. So I'm going to show a little bit. Mm -hmm. Good on the down tilt, definitely could catch Ness on rising aerials, which he usually tends to go for, but forward air is a little bit disjointed, plus <laughs> it's Wi Fi. <laughs> Can't be difficult to deal with. Good on the side magnet here for oh. the combo, but Ben comes back, doesn't able to connect the up air, I'm sorry, up tilt, but Syrup still surviving. 109, Ness makes it. Great recovery, in. but sneaks in the back here. Okay, nice, he's the knight to cover him a little bit, but he's still at the ledge. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. Very, very rough spot to be in. Honestly, yeah. Um, 
It was difficult to avoid that purely because Syrup was already covering the roll distance at first. So I made Vin like not want to buffer a roll on stage. Yeah. Plus he re the ledge too, so the only situation where he would be okay is if he neutral get up and then up smash I'm sorry, down smash covers both down smash and up smash covers roll. So yeah, you're right, it's a very difficult spot for Vin. Um I felt like the minute he let go of ledge he should have, I'm sorry, the first time he let go of the ledge, he probably should have gone for a flowers win, but I think the other thing that Vin could have done was get up attack as well. Yeah, get up attack definitely was the play there, but I think it might have just been a, um, like an autopilot or, you know, muscle memory type thing to immediately do the up yeah. without seeing the down smash. But that's a good win for Syrup. I think if you can beat Vin in this matchup, it's pretty impressive. Because probably one of his most played ones. Yeah. Yeah, Venon Venon Phil used to go back and forth in Vegas in a lot of offline tournaments. Definitely. And it like this is, you know, the best Zelda, so like who really who really knows like this matchup that way. Yeah, also. Ben go Ben goes all the way back to all his brawl like Wi-Fi, so he's definitely got some years on him in terms of being his Zelda main, so. Oh, nice catch. Yeah, he had to be very careful at the ledge there. Honestly, uh, it's... Yeah, he should have just committed to using his upbeat to ledge instead of just trying to jump there. It's like the best thing he could have done to avoid the knight. But now let's see what happens here. Uh, this is like the first time we saw how Serb has to play when he's behind. Oh! Oh, hey! Oh, What's thanks, up? bro. Bro, thanks for the sub. Yeah, dude, thank you for the sub. Nice. Good. I thought to kind of go around the knight a little bit in terms of the charge time, and then go for the back there as well. Very good. Ooh. He couldn't see him charging forward smash because he, of the knight. Even I couldn't see it, but that's kind of one of the beauty, beautiful things about Zelda, I guess, is she can do a lot with knight. Especially the way Zen uses it. He has like so many crazy setups. Okay, off stage. Not gonna double jump into that down air. He's definitely looking for it. Sneaks in the sweet spot for there as well. Ooh, almost gets put in a jab lock situation. Yeah, Vin is getting to press whatever buttons he wants now. It's yeah, kinda he, rough. He's, he's been freed from the chains of Ness. Oh, nice poke, but no kill, man. Wow! Oh, that was very yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, what? Who does that? <laughs> it's crazy. It's a crazy t thing to do, but I'm not kind of not surprised about it because the first thing that you'll probably see Ness do is fast fall forward air because it'll catch with the ledge. <laughs> so then, so then going for the forward air at that timing was well thought out. Definitely, really good for me. Yeah, that's the but first like, thing I see Ness do, especially like when they got when they're at the ledge at that situation. Yeah, very good. Really good turnaround from the first game. Yeah, it was like once Vin had the lead, it looked really difficult for Serp to you know come back from that. It was like the first time we saw how Vin can play when he's the one that doesn't have to really you know go in versus Ness. Alright. Might be just getting a stage switch here. We've been playing on Pokemon Stadium only for like the past few few uh, sets already. Yeah, that's why we kinda gave up the name Starter Stadium too. Three, two, okay, one. got town for game three. Let's see if uh Sarah can close this one out. Yeah. Serp will have a little bit more space to play with, but in tangent Zelda will as well. Oh, the knight actually covered the hitbox from Ness and that game went some time to attack with with neutral V. Man, Ben is just catching these landings so consistently now. Yeah. Watch out. Okay, nice. I feel it's like Vin was ready for that jump there. I, I feel he put the knight there specifically to try to cover a jump, but he just missed it. Yeah. 
Now it's kind of one of those things that you have to factor as oh. no, sorry, no, sorry, because he did it in place and syrup went for a touch back. Yeah, he didn't know which direction he was going to go with that. That's the scariest part about Bowers winning this. Oh, system. nice. Wow. Yeah, Vin this time didn't go for the EFB. He went for the upper. Wasn't expecting a train with Ness. Now, this game, like, Vin's hitting almost every uh, Nehru slip. Before, Surf was just holding Shiver's but I guess he's getting caught dashing a little bit too much. There it is again. Okay, nice. Intercepts the Knight with that PK fire. Go oh, high. Nice. Barely avoids it, but wow, still sneaks in the up air. Okay, watch out. I'll watch your land. He's oh, nice. Vin. Pointing the grab. Yeah, I'm not amazed Vin has an up smash team yet. I feel like he. Oh, dang. Copy yeah. drift. With that dash, dash back, forward smash. But uh, yeah, I feel like Vin is really calling up these jumps, but he's not getting a super hard punch for it just yet. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. Start, yeah, nice. Because he the hitbox, so he can break through. Nice. That was very good recovery. Hit through the down smash hitbox and everything. Oh, nice. Wow. Yeah, Vin, I think he didn't expect him to just go deep off stage like that. Even though he's been doing it pretty often. Okay. I like a, I like a little bit of both. Oh! Down to the last stock here, landing his couple of the dash attack. Again, uh, okay, yep. Yeah. Nope. Baiting out the nearest finally again. Not letting Vin get away with that move for free anymore. Oh, no sweet spots, nice! I like uh, it too, because of that situation should Syrup might have let go to shield trying to see where he was going to land, but... Good stuff on defense oh. to make the recovery, nice. He's in a tough spot here, yeah. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Still tough, very, still very tough. Yeah, 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 really good pressure here. But the dash back forward smash gets him out of that, the corner. Carries the knight, he's under, oh, he's under a lot of, a lot of pressure. He is so hard to get away from Zelda there. Yeah, that air dodge cost him. Because where he air dodged, he air dodged back to disadvantage.